All right, I just got out of the Toronto Old Book and Paper Show, and uh, Jamie and I decided to hit this up because they might have, you know, not just old comics, but like old pulps and old uh, paperbacks, etc. Um, this is a show that I think happens twice a year. This is the fall one. Um, so I got a whole bunch of stuff. As you can see here, I got a Star Week. What is Star Week? Well, if you're in Toronto, if you're in the uh, Toronto area, you know that Star Week was the, is still the, uh, TV guy that comes with the Saturday Star. Um, this is what I grew up on. Um, my family did not get TV Guide. They got Star Weeks. So I got some uh, old Star Weeks, beginning with this. Here's this with uh, Mario. Uh, here's this profile of um, uh, WKRP. A Live Aid retrospective. Uh, seasons, uh, so, sorry, greetings from Memphis. I remember having this in the house. A Sonny and Cher retrospective. These prices uh, were marked severely down, by the way. Um, D-Day, uh, I'm filming this on the day before, Remembrance Day here in Canada. Um, I also got some uh, fun comics. I got this A-Team Annual 1986 Look at this. So this is like storybooks and stuff. Pretty cool stuff. So what this show is, is just old paper anything. They had catalogs and stuff too. Um, here I've got this uh, Little Shop of Horrors official movie adaptation. Apparently they couldn't spring for the rights of any likenesses or anything. It's DC Comics. Pretty cool stuff. Um, another comic, the uh, Hellraiser 3 Hell on Earth um, comic adaptation. Pretty cool. Yeah, so they basically have like, um, you know, programs and they have like menus. And they have anything that's paper from uh, the olden days or even like newer stuff. Mostly old stuff. A lot of World War II um, memorabilia and things like this. Um, I also got this Star Wars making of the movie. This is copyright 1980. So pretty cool. Um, it's basically um, a making of thing for kids. Pretty interesting to look through now. Got this fun weird thing. Um, the Empire Strikes Back mix and match storybook. So you can open it up. You can mix and match settings. Uh, Luke was hiding behind a rock and you can flip these to any setting. Uh, there's a stormtrooper, etc. So Pretty cool. Got these old TV guides. You have this 1981 uh, Johnny's 19th anniversary. <laughs> uh, this Simpsons one inside Sim uh, Homer's head. This X Files one. I have to check if I have this one. I think I do. <laughs> um, Cheers, the last call. Uh, the last episode of Cheers. And another Simpsons one for Christmas. And that's what I got. Oh, no, wait. I got a few other things. I totally forgot. Um, these are awesome. I got to dig into a bag back here. All right. You ready? Little Big Books. So this is uh, Dick Tracy and the Hotel Murders. These are little books that... I don't know why it's having trouble focusing. Every page has a, a text on one page and art on the other. And these were a big deal uh, back in the 30s and stuff. Uh, this one, I think, is... Uh, you usually have a copyright. Yeah, I was able to find copyrights for these, but I think this is the 1930s. Uh, here's another one. Dick Tracy Special FBI Operative. There's another one. Dick Tracy the Super Detective. See the back here. Other little big books. Or big little books. And last but not least, The Shadow. Someone put a plastic over it. That's cool. The Better Little Book. There you go. 
I hope to be going through these uh, on my channel. I never have the time to do all the stuff I say I'm going to do, but I, I love to eventually go through all these on, on the channel, so that'll be a lot of fun. Um, that's what I got at this um, old paper, uh, old book and paper show in Toronto. Um, hope to go to the next one. So until next time, take care.